I've just recorded this whole video. And it's come up with error. <laughs> Hi everyone, if you're new here, my name is Anna and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, it's going to be a little bit of a different one and a little bit of a spontaneous one. So basically, long story short, I filmed this whole video and my little trusty SD card decided to come up with memory card error and format my whole SD card, which in simpler terms means my whole SD card with like over a year's worth of footage and everything on it is gone. So, yeah, I could have cried about it. Um, if I was having a bad day, I probably would have cried about it. But I've let it go. I'm all good about it. And basically, on my other SD card, basically, obviously, I've got, like, loads of different SD cards. Basically, I have got a lot of SD cards. And I managed to record some more. Basically, I refilmed the rest of the video on another card. And I've actually didn't know what to do with the video then because at this point i spoke about the dress i'd done the first impressions on this dress and the video was just a bit flat so i decided to add in the day i went shopping to buy all this stuff from primark i actually did record in there and do like a little vlog type of thing it's not huge it's not mega but it is still a vlog nevertheless so i decided to make this video a come shop with me and a testing out an 18 pound primark dress so yeah, that is going to be today's video. I really hope that you enjoyed it and we'll let the video do the talking. If you liked it and you want me to do more like this, then let me know. But yeah, this is going to be today's video and I really hope that you do enjoy it. Let's go. Morning everyone. Welcome back to today's vlog. Um, I've lost my tripod. I am going to bring you with me today. I have actually no idea where it's gone. Not a clue. I mean, okay, when I say my hair is frizzy today, it's really not an exaggeration. I'm going to brush it out. Oh, look how frizzy it is. I'm going to straighten it quick and then I will come straight back to you. Hi everyone! If you're new here, my name is Anna and welcome back to my channel. Today's video it is morning right now, so this video is going to last the whole day. And this is going to be, I'm not sure what I'm going to call it yet, I'm not going to lie. But yeah, um, I haven't got any makeup on. As you can tell, this hair still looks a bit weird. Still got a little bit of skin out as you go in, but it's all good. Let me get on with the video. I'm going to get dressed now. I mean, it's windy. It's it's very windy today. So I wear, depending on the weather, I'm not sure. So this is what I'm wearing. The same dress I literally always wear. But I really don't literally got the same dress on I literally wear all the time. Do it so it looks like. Dun 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 dun. No. Look at them, they're like rose gold. I like that pink dress as well. I like this because it's elasticated, but hopefully it ain't fit. This so reminds me of something my granny would wear. Oh my god, I love it. I am obsessed with this. This is giving me such Zara vibes and I love it. I'm supposed to be shopping for Harriet, but I'm getting a little bit distracted. They have so much like Disney stuff, merch stuff, Harry Potter, Prince, Riverdale. I love Riverdale, but I don't think I would wear merch from there. Dirty Dancing, Bridesmaids. I'm obsessed with this. It's my favourite film. How insane are these gold plant pots? Okay, There's so some this one I got from m and and I think these ones are like literally only like six pound. And they've got so many like nice baskets too and I love those flower pots. So I've just been in, I've got two huge massive bags wasn't actually supposed to get anything for me but i got everything for harriet and then i spent a bit of money on me as well right guys so i've got the dress on and um, this is the pattern of it oh we're really far in that's why you can't see me right so this is what the dress looks like right now i've got on my favorite dress at the moment and this is the one where it's literally if i step back them on okay so this is this one i don't know if i like it i feel like out of all of them it's the most slimming 
it's the most slimming. I feel like it's very sophisticated though. I don't feel like it's like, it's probably the most me thing out of this video. It's something I would wear every day. It's like an everyday dress, as I usually say. Um, trainers like my Air Force or my Converse, my Vans. It could look quite different. Like, what do you think? So yeah, that is what today's video is going to be. The dress is from Primark. I got it a couple of weeks ago. This dress cost £18. I did this video last week for another dress that cost £18. And which I think is why a lot of people wanted me to record this one. So you can see what it looked like, what it fit like, the material and stuff like that. So yeah, that's going to be today's video. And I feel like the only way to get this video started is for me to try the dress on. So I've just recorded this whole video. And it's come up with error. <laughs> I would be lying if this wasn't the third time I've filmed this video because my camera has lost the footage three times. But, you know, we're back. I feel like, right, I feel like I'm really repeating myself now. But, yeah, I love the neckline. I feel like the neckline is beautiful. At first, I wasn't sure about it because I didn't know if it made my shoulders look more broad. But I do actually really, really like it. And I feel, feel, feel like, and if it was a top, I would really like it. However, this is what the dress looks like. So this is it. As you can see, I feel like I look like not to sound rude. I don't want to offend anyone. I feel like this would make a really good like maternity dress. I don't like it. I feel like this is my biggest area and I feel like it's really emphasising that. It's really cutting in and flying out where I wouldn't want to. When I wear dresses, I prefer it to fit like up here. If this was a dress and it was like this, I feel like it would be perfect. It's not. I mean, this dress costs... 18 pound and that's why i wanted to do this video i wanted to show tell you guys if i thought it's worth it in terms of quality the material and everything out of 10 would i pay the money i'd call it a five i wouldn't i don't even know if that makes sense i wouldn't pay the money for it. i don't feel like it's worth 18 pounds i've got dresses from asos which i've paid which i've paid similar money for and in all honesty they feel very similar quality like the exact same and if not better yes for a size 20 i feel like it fits and in terms of fitting for plus size women this size i feel like the sizing is actually very very good for a change which is very odd um, i'm gonna show what it looks like with a belt i've done this four times already so yeah let's show you what it looks like the first time i filmed this it was like a first impression i hadn't seen it with a belt but at this point i've seen it um what is your opinion with the belt do you think it looks right I still don't think it looks right. I still don't love it. I feel like I prefer it more with a belt. But do I love it with a belt? No. Like, I feel like at this point, here it looks really pretty. And then it's just down my hips. I don't love it. So, yeah, I don't really feel like... I feel like I'm... <laughs> love it i love the pattern i feel like it's definitely very zara-esque i feel like it's a dress you'd get from zara um if you can really appreciate the detail this is what the detail looks like it's beautiful i feel like it goes really really nice with my nails um and you could star this with anything really because because the actual dress is black and white i feel like you've got endless amounts of options of how you could style it how you could upstyle it or how you can wear it you could really wear this with a leather jacket you could wear it in the winter with a pair of black bike boots i feel like that could look really pretty but um yeah what do you guys think please be honest with me and do you think it looks good would you keep it would you return i think personally i would return it because i don't feel like it looks right on me but that's up to you to come in and tell me so that is today's video i really hope that you enjoyed it i'm so sorry if it feels rushed but i filmed this three times and i feel like i've really repeated myself now i mean i'll check and see what i've said in car if i've repeated myself which i probably have but you know so yeah comment down below what you think of the dress i would love to know we are on the road to 4,000 subscribers which is crazy to me so make sure you hit the subscribe button like this video and comment down below and i will see you in my next one bye